Hey, snake. Oh, shit. 80. Oh, Jesus. What? How'd my armor break? There's a millipede. Of course there is. What's going on, guys? And welcome back to another episode of Arc Aberration Ascended. Last we left off, we tamed a couple of Gigantoraptors. This is the uh, 127 mutated Gigantoraptor that we tamed from like the 75 that we tamed. So yeah, we got a couple of Gigantoraptors. So once we got the first Gigantoraptor, we were able to get the other two with ease. But yeah, this is our Gigantoraptor looking all gorgeous and whatever. But that's not what we're doing today. In today's video, I would like to finally get a girlfriend for Rampage. Either that or a, a much stronger male. I mean, this guy was only a 115. So he's not really that strong, if you really think about it. But we could get like a, a better... A better male or even a female and then we could breed them up maybe get an imprinted pack and we'll see what a pack of ravagers can do so that's kind of the goal right there I might just take you with us just in case we find something I'm gonna drop the prime yeah just in case we find like a baby worth taming just in case all right so what was I gonna do oh yeah put this spino away we got like a couple more Spinos, and here are the other Gigantoraptors. This was the 75 that we initially tamed first, and this one's the 50 male, and then this one's the female. So if we wanted to, we could breed them up, the mutated one. Hmm, alright. But yeah, we're gonna see if we could find a girlfriend for Rampage, and you know what? We're gonna take Rampage out. Because I haven't taken Rampage out in a very long time. We could take the bear out, but I don't have a saddle for the bear yet. I'd like to get a stronger bear aside from Estelle. Maybe like a 130 or something. But whatever we find. You know what we should do first? Maybe repair our crossbow as well as get more trank arrows. Still have no idea what to do with these. Do I demolish? It's only giving me the option to demolish. How are we supposed to get the fruit? Do I demolish them? Yeah, I don't really know what to do with this plant. So if any of you have any suggestions, let me know in the comments. Because I'd like to get to taming a Yi Ling at some point. Oh, and we should probably get stronger armor. Maybe some chitin armor? Let's learn the chitin armor real quick. Just so we have, like, stronger armor. We have so much chitin. Might as well use it. Alright, we got narco berries. We just need a bunch of spoiled meat. Do we have any narcotic in here? We got plenty of narcotic in here. Okay, we'll use that then. Alright, let's see what we got for spoiled meat. We're probably going to run out of stone arrows before we run out of narcotic. Alright, let's head out on Rampage. See if we can find anything. Either a girlfriend for Rampage or a stronger male. I'm thinking maybe 130 might be the, the weakest we go. Yeah, 130 is the lowest level. I won't expect anything higher than that. Also, I will keep an eye out for any... I got the Gigantoraptor, just in case we run into any more baby Gigantoraptors. Maybe like a max level or something. What about these guys? 80, 35, and 90. Not the greatest levels. And we got one over here. 35. Might as well kill these Spinos just so we can make room for more. Oh, right, I can't attack while in the water. That's so stupid. Being unable to attack while in the water. Why do they do that with Ravagers? No, no, come back here. I've got a Ravager here. That's a 65. We could definitely do better than that. He's got a friend. That was the alpha. That's a 25. So the 65 was an alpha. Oh, we killed a Cosmo. Sorry about that, buddy. I forgot the the um the Ravager can attack in the water for some reason. 
I don't know if that's intentional or if that's a bug or something. Knowing them, it's deliberate. Knowing them, it's deliberate, but whatever. And then it's not gonna get fixed. Okay, those are our Spinos. I mean, I'm not actively searching for a high-level Spino. I just need either a, at least a girlfriend for for Rampage. Of course, if I find like a max level Spino or something, then, I, then I'll tame it. <clears throat> we got 117 arrows, that's more than enough. That's a 20 Spino. So luckily that crash ended up happening last episode because we were able to get the Gigantoraptors after all because in an alternate universe, they did die. That's a 40 Raptor. We could do better than that. I think our 145 is a female, so if we can get a high-level male, we can breed up a couple of raptors and get a pack one and get some packs. Oh, Jesus. Ouch. Okay, I'm leaving. Tree, get out the way. Ah, and the game crashed. I know that noise from anywhere. Uh, all right. Um, excuse me, guys, while I fix some technical difficulties. Okay, and we're back. Sorry about that, guys. The uh, game crashed again, which means, you know, it set us back. So yeah, it took me back before I killed these Spinos. It actually took me back to base, so back before I did all that traveling. So we're going to go this way and see what happens. Since the game wants to crash on me. A game, please don't crash again. I literally just started recording. I'm going to save just in case it does. Just in case. I mean, if we have to go to the bioluminescent cave, we will. We'll just stay away from the water. That's all we'll do. All right, last time I passed one of you, the game crashed. What do we got, a level 40? And it's a male. Oh, I killed an 85 Cosmo. Are right, you at friends? You're a level 5. Let's kill you. Lovely, you're a 20. Ouch. Uh, bears, why are you attacking me? I didn't do anything to you. Preferably a 130 Ravager, no lower than a 130. 125, if there's nothing else there, I might take a 125. Ooh, metal. You know, I'll take that. I'll take that metal. I found some metal rocks. Awesome. So we can use that to make ingots or whatever. Come on, Rock, get destroyed. What are you doing? How are you still standing? Is this Rock secretly Elton John? What the hell? Okay, come on, please get destroyed. Well, how are you still standing? If this was a stone pick, it would have been broken by now. Okay, finally, damn. Alright, how much metal did we get from that? 162. You think that would be good enough? At least we know there's metal here. Let's mark it on the map. And you know what? I'm going to save it here, just in case the game crashes. All right, so this way here, I know where to get metal. If we have to go down to the bioluminescent cave, what we'll do is we'll bring the Gigantoraptor down there. Because we got the Gigantoraptor, why not use it? There's a 125 male. Hmm. You know what? No. We're looking for a female. Yeah, there was a 125 male, but that's not kind of quite not quite what we're looking for. All right, we might as well turn on the light pet because if we don't, that's how the nameless get us. All right, last time we were down here, we kind of had like a little bit of trouble. Like we were getting attacked by snakes, we were getting attacked by everything. There's a Megalosaur, we'll level you 60. If I can find like a 130 or something, we'll definitely tame it. And with a baby, even better. There's a baby Ravager. So, oh, hello. A 50 and a 20. And you are a 40. Alright, not what we're looking for. Okay, we got a couple Ravagers here. What level are you? We got an 80 and a 20. We can definitely do better than that. Looks like the Megalosaur is losing to the Roll Rats. Yeah, I'm just gonna let the Roll Rats deal with them. They know what they're doing. Alright, Roll Rat, he's dead. Chill out. Thank you.
You know, I'm gonna save. I'm probably gonna constantly save, you know, just because the game might crash again, so... And there's a max level somewhere. Is it the Pyromane? No, that's a level 80. I mean, we might go for the level 80 when we tame a Pyromane at some point. I thought I saw another one over there. Yeah, as long as we kind of, you know, keep our distance, we should be okay. That's a 25 Ankylo. We should be okay as long as we keep our distance. Hey, snake. Oh. 80. Oh, Jesus. What? How'd my armor break? There's a millipede. Of course there is. How dare you break all my armor? God damn it. All my chitin armor gone and now I'm completely naked. Well, at least I've still got my old armor. And I've got some spare armor, in case I need it. All my armor broke. I'm gonna have to repair it at some point. I did not see that R for Plura. That was the problem. Ah, all right. Well, at least we've got extra armor. So, good thing I brought my old armor. <laughs> yep. So we're back to cloth. You could say back to square one. That's a pyromane right there. Okay, yeah, how are we supposed to get out of here? Who levels this pyromane? Okay, that's a 10. Not... Not bad. We can definitely one-shot it, but it will burn us. Hello, pyromane. Please don't hurt me. Oh, right. Yeah, I'm in the water. Yeah, it went out. It went out. Good. All right, we can't attack in the water. I forgot we couldn't attack in the water. Oh, hello, Demetrodon. First Demetrodon we've seen. No, crab, don't chase me. I don't have time for you right now. Well, at least we don't have to worry about that pyromane anymore. That was the 55. Oh, we got an explorer note. That's the nameless dossier. Nice. All right. This was a bad idea. I can say that. This was a bad idea. All right, we got an Arthropleura. We don't want to attack that. Kill that snake. Okay, there is a 145 male. We could tame its... There's a baby there. We could tame its baby. All right, everyone, everyone, piss off. You're a level 10. All right, you can die. All right, where'd that 145 baby go? We could switch over to the Gigantoraptor. Actually, you know what? That's what we'll do. All right, Gigantoraptor, this is where you come in. All right, where is it? I see it. I see the little icon. It's a 145, I can't wait. Am I high enough level? Yes, I am, good. Ah, right, we did it. Oh yeah, because we didn't level it up, it got it didn't get bonus levels. Well, we got one anyway. We got a 145 male. If we could find a female, then that'd be golden. What level is this Megalosaur? 20? You know, while I'm on the Gigantoraptor, let's kill it. Yeah, I never leveled this one up. That's right, die. Alright, we got 32 levels. Let's level you up. Maybe get you up to, say, 50,000 health. About 1,000 weight, if we can. And then just put the rest into melee. Alright, now you're level 200. You should be able to get more levels. All right, Gigantoraptor, good job. And now, Rampage, you can come back out. We still need a female, but at least we've got a relatively high level one now. Ouch. Ooh, that's an Alpha Basilisk. Oh, God. Run, run, run. I'm just running. Run, 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 run. There's another Gigantoraptor. What will you? Excuse me. If you're a good level, you're a 50. If you could have been a 150, that would have been perfect. Snake, piss off. Yeah, that's the Alpha Basilisk. I don't want to mess with that. That's the same Alpha Basilisk we ran into when we dealt with the 
what was it? When we tamed Rampage. There's a green drop here. Let's see if we can pick that up. You know what? A chitin shirt. That's fine. Not that it matters or anything, because Arthur Plura will one-shot it regardless of how strong your armor is. Can I just pick up this drop real quick? More sap taps and a slightly better hatchet. Alright, sounds good. Save the game, just in case. There's also a 140 Basilisk. We might, if it still exists, we might go after that 140 Basilisk at some point. Tame it so we can have a Basilisk of our own. I wish flyers were an aberration. That would make traversing the map a lot easier. I mean, I get why they're not in the game, because it defeats the purpose of gliders, but still. Oh, hello. 135 female. You know what? That will work. No, don't, don't go after the stago. 26 points into health, 20 into melee. It doesn't seem too bad. I mean, you are a 135, so that's to be expected. And then I guess we'll see who has better stats of the two males, Rampage or the other male that we tamed up. All right, and down it goes. Awesome. All right, we got him. We got some, do we have any prime in our inventory? We've got a couple of prime. That'll be good enough for now. And there we have it. 135 female has been tamed. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna head back home and then we're gonna we're gonna see the stats of the female and then compare the two males and see which one would be a better breeder. Would it be Rampage or the new male that we got? The new 145 male. And then we'll breed them up. We'll get like maybe three of them and then we'll see what a pack of them can do. All right. So we'll take out the male, we'll have the male that we tamed up, the 145 male, and we'll compare stats and see what goes on. Hello, bear, what level are you? Five? All right, cool. All right, so let's compare the three Ravagers. We've got the female and we got the two males. We've got Rampage and the other one that we tamed. So the female had 40 points into health, 34 into stamina, oxygen food, no one cares, 31 into weight, and 30 into melee. While Rampage had 29 into health, 21 into stamina, oxygen, food, no one cares, 26 into weight, and 44 into melee. Okay, so if we can get this female's health and Rampage's melee, 29 and 15, yeah, Rampage is clearly better. So what you, you might be a guard dog. You could be like a backup male, just in case we need you. I might think of a name for you. You know, I'll think of a name for you right now. Since we have Rampage, you can be Chaos. I'll name you Chaos. Chaos the Ravager. As for the female... Okay, that's the Gigantoraptor. As I was saying, as for the female... We could name you, and you're the Alpha. Awesome. Let's name you Havoc. You can be Havoc. So let's go ahead. Behavior, enable mating. Behavior, enable mating. Breed up our Ravagers, get an imprinted version. Rampage is clearly the better male, so we'll use him. He's got 44... Oh yeah, I forgot. For a 115, he has really good melee. I forgot about that. Since you're kind of a parenter and whatever, how about Nanny? Nanny the Gigantoraptor. That's what we'll name you. So what we'll do is we'll wait for these guys to get an imprinted version. And then we'll see how, how good the imprinted version is. And uh, I'll breed up a couple of them. See what happens here. If we get triplets, then we'll only do the one breed session. If we get twins, we'll do two. And if we get a 1Z, we'll do three. All right. Baby has been born. So let's see what kind of stats you've got. You did lose the health, so you probably won't do at all. Hmm. We'll let them keep breeding. I'll let them keep breeding on my spare time. You know what? We'll test this one out. This won't be our main one. This is more of a test subject, just to see how strong it is. It did keep the melee, though. That's the good news. So, yeah. 
Once we get, like, the perfect stats, I kind of want one with the perfect stats. So we should be good to go on there. All right, so we'll wait for this baby to be fully grown. And then on my spare time, I'll try to get the perfect male and the perfect female. So we can breed them up, get an imprint, get more mutations maybe and whatever. You know, let me see what happens if I demolish that plant species Z. Will I get the fruit if I do? Great, there are crabs guarding the area. Okay, as I was saying before those crabs interrupted us, what happens if I demolish this? It only gives me the option to demolish. Oh! We got 12 fruit. If we wanted to, we could tame a Yi Ling next episode. Or try to, anyway. Alright, Nanny, you can go back in the base. And then we could put off the cave till next episode. Yeah, we could definitely do that. Alright, so let's go ahead and level you up 11 more times. So this is our test subject, Ravager. It kept the melee, so that's good anyway. Even though it did lose the health. So it's not quite the perfect stats. Left click. 269 with the left click. We missed. And then 269 with the right click. And I think C... Yeah, C is a roar. All right, 3,800. Yep, we should be good to go. So yeah, on my spare time, I'll breed up a couple more. And then what we might do next episode is try to tame up a Yi Ling. I'll see if I still got that biotoxin. And then hopefully we'll be good to go there. You know what I might call you? I might call you Wrath. You can be Wrath. So you'll probably be our new Ravager. The daughter of... The daughter of Rampage and Havoc. Who are now breeding again. Alright? Cool. So you know what I might do? I might put the... Do I still got the biotoxin? We got so much organic polymer. Alright. These spoil in six hours in my inventory. Six hours here. Alright, so it doesn't make a difference. They'll still spoil in six hours. Alright. We got the plant species Z fruit. Which we use as grenades. Alright. We've still got the... Yeah, we got 11 biotoxin. We should be good to go when it comes to that. Alright, so, yeah, on my spare time, I'll let the the Ravagers breed up. But yeah, with that, that's going to have to wrap it up for this episode. If you guys enjoyed it, make sure to leave a like and subscribe for more. It will really help out a ton. But until next time, I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.